Liberty Hockey cruised to a 15-4 record in the first semester with an overall ranking of fifth in the nation. A surprising feat considering the Flames had 11 new faces on the roster. This young team found instant chemistry and Kirk Candy points to one reason for that. That's because we've got such a great senior uh, leadership group in here that uh, that put that as their top priority, you know, team chemistry. And, and we knew the guys we were bringing in were going to be great for our team culture. Yeah, we wanted to make it a real point of emphasis to, to reach out to these guys and really connect with them on a personal level. So that when we all got together as a team that it would really, you know, gel together and work well. And the way we were able to come together was just a lot of fun. And that instant chemistry would allow the Flames to find the strength of their game early. It's speed for us. We're all over the ice. We want to be in our opponents' faces all night. And we know we're really talented, so if we can have the puck as much as possible, we know we have the best chance of winning. You know, we're a really fast team. Um, the way we can transition you know, off the rush and create offense that way. And also, we're a really big team, too, so we can use our, our physical side to you know, just play that game and kind of create offense that way. The secret weapon for LU, however, has been having fans back in the stands. You know, we were deprived last year and having fans here this year has been the most amazing thing. You know, we, we don't take it for granted and everybody shows up and you can feel the energy on the ice and it absolutely impacts how we play. It's been a lot of fun. The energy in the building has been unbelievable. Second half of the year uh, with some great opponents coming in town, I'd imagine the building will be uh, full for the rest of the year. As they look to the second semester, the Flames do have some areas to improve upon to be a true national contender. There's things that we can tweak, such as I think that we can be a little more consistently dangerous around the net, and that's when we have chances to to score. Uh, we need to bear down on it. You know, we aren't going to blow teams out of the water at 9-2 as we go down the stretch here. They're going to be tight games, and we got to bear down the scoring chance that we have. I think we just need, you know, 100% commitment from everybody on the team, and we just need everybody to buy in, buy into the systems, and, you know, just commit to coming to the rink every day and, for one, have fun, but also just work hard and, you know, we're going to, there's nothing that we can't do with this team. Really looking forward to the second half of this journey uh, in, into the national tournament. I really feel like, uh, you know, this group has, has great potential and a great opportunity to do some real special things.